Hi, my friend. Today I want to talk about in God's hands, but also I want to say something. You know, I've always said that we're an honest church. We're an honest message. And uh, uh, several, more than several, hundreds, maybe thousands have said, uh, why does he wear a hat on the broadcast? Well, some of you know that I've been under chemotherapy and it's working well, but I've lost all my hair. And uh, so I want to show you, I'm bald as a cucumber, but I'm not comfortable with it yet. And people say, but you look good. Well, I don't know. Uh, Right now, I prefer the hat. You have to place all that concerns you into God's loving care. It's one of the secrets of life. To have faith in God is to place yourself and all that concerns you, everything, into God's loving care. And to know that God's care is loving. So many people have a God that is out to get them. A God that is just with folded arms like Clint Eastwood on a bad day waiting to get you. That's not true. Here is the honesty. God cares for you and guides you to what is best for you. Trust God to show you the way and God will. It's kind of like a loving parent. God gently leads you to your good. Place all of your affairs into God's loving care. And through every circumstance, through every challenge, God will sustain you and support you when you need it the absolute most. In Luke 22 or Luke 23, rather, 46, it says this, Father, into thy hands I commit my spirit. This is not just a death. This is a daily activity of committing your spirit to God, knowing that you will sense the great comfort and and peace as you think about yourself resting in God's love. God is at work in your life. And also it gives you profound peace to know that God is at work in the lives of your dear ones, near and far. Sometimes that's a great anxiety that you can't be with people that are far. You affirm in prayer. Your and their oneness in spirit. You affirm in prayer the unity of purpose in bringing about God's good. You place today all that concerns you, mind, body, and soul, into God's loving care. And as you do so, There is a complete commitment of your spirit that will happen. And you'll realize that God has your back and your sides and your front. And that God protects you. And that God is continually watching over you and your life. Your life in the present and your life in the future. I wish you incredible, great blessings in this knowledge. Amen.